Greetings, everyone. This is First Centurion 753 with the next episode of Dawn of Man, uh, playing the Northland campaign. We have our settlement here. Let's see, we're gonna. In the last episode, we survived another winter, and uh, we dealt with several threats: blizzards, hypothermia, wolf attack. I wanted to do some hunting at the end of the last fall, and I never got around to it, so I'm gonna do some now. Bison. Ooh, bison would be a good one to kill, probably. That would give us good food niche. I'm not sure how popular this series is on the channel, but I like it, and I know certain people do, so I'm gonna stick with it. Don't worry. Um, try to get us to the end of the uh, time period here, if we can get to the... Uh... Well, there's actually a lot of milestones. You know what? There are a lot of milestones in this campaign, the Northland campaign, that I haven't... Uh completed and so I probably want to complete all them and get to steel making if I can. There is an achievement to get our settlement up to 50 which I think I'll be doing very easily. Let's go ahead and that bison right now. Um, that is a bone spear. Where's our bison? Right there. And let's get some of the people that are close by so they can go sort of at the same speed. This guy is another one rondering around. It's good to get kills early in the spring because that's when the uh, you have the best chance of acquiring the goods. You don't want people going long distances, not goods. Yeah, the goods, the resources from the hunt. You don't want people. Oh, there's a woolly rhino. I want a woolly rhino for my birthday. Woolly rhino for my birthday. Let me see. Hold on. Why am I saying that? Um, check this out. Alright, so, we get two more Megalosauruses. How many bison? Boars. I haven't killed a bison yet. That'll be one knowledge point. Great. Woolly Rhinos, we're going to need uh, four to get two knowledge points. Ancient bison and a bison. This isn't an ancient bison, though. It's a regular bison. Oh, did I build the flint thing? i got to build the flint thing. Hold on. I want to kill the bison. Wait a minute. Pause so I can see everything I'm doing. I forgot about flint. Production. Oh crud! I have to get into metallurgy. Oh, that stinks. Let me see here. I can't build the mine unless I'm into metallurgy. And metallurgy. Where is metallurgy? Copper smelting, brewing, iron mine. Where's metallurgy? I am not seeing it on here. Oh, there it is. Underground mining. Ah, damn. Okay. So I have to do above ground stuff if I can. Although, you know what? The flint. There's not going to be a lot of above... Oh, there's some above that ground flint. We should get this. Seven. Alright, so I'm going to create a work area here. For that... Flint collection. Right there. Alright, good. Um, is there any other flint in the vicinity? That's megalithic. There's a flint, potential flint mine. So, whoa. Right on the other side. Multiple flint mines. All right, so let's just go mine this thing. Flat out, just gonna mine this sucker. Add that as something that needs to be mined. There's another megalosaurus. We're gonna get the megalosauruses. It's critical to get this stuff, like, when you can, because a lot of these animals go extinct later on in the game. And I don't think I've had any extinctions yet. What is that? Oh, the woolly rhino. Gotta get a big group for the woolly rhino. I'm sending three guys after the, each one of these. That's just so I can catch the thing. And three of them take on the woolly rhino. 
Because you don't need to catch this thing, you just need to survive it. Because he will fight back the rhino. The rhino is going to come after you. I don't think this guy's a sign anywhere. Alright, we got a lot of hunting going on this spring. Spring hunts underway. Check these guys out on the first kill, hopefully, of the season. Ooh, there's a spear, so we get it. It's coming after us. It's, a, it's attacking. The bison is no match for the human. Z. Three skins, five meat, and one bone. Very good. Now, what about the others? Uh-oh, cave lion attack. Where's that? It's like multiple cave lions. One guy killed by a cave lion. Oh man, there's too many of them. Uh, I know what I can do here. Dogs are doing pretty good. I think the dogs did a really good job there. They saved us. We lost one guy. Three skins and one meat from the cave lion. Alright, nice. Good dog protection there. Now, what about the rest of the hunts? Will a rhino hunt? Somebody got killed. Was he part of the Megalosaurus hunting party? Where is that hunting party? I don't even know where the Megalosaurus is anymore. Maybe he cut across. Oh no, these guys were going for flint. That's when the cave lions got him. Wow, this is definitely a harsher territory. This thing's an easy kill, if I can get it. And there's more flint over there. Going to get raw meat. Old man died. Well, I guess he was going to die soon anyways. Okay. Where's the rest of my settlement? We're pretty, pretty, pretty busy with a lot of tasks right now, I think. I don't know where that Megalosaurus party went after. No flint. I'm going to see where these, what these guys do. Oh, we got four here. Good. Major, this would be a big kill here if we can kill it. Rhino attack! Oh my god! This thing takes the head. Whew. You need at least four. Somebody got speared by that uh, rhino spike. Twelve! Wow! That is a big catch there. And we're going after the Megasaurus too. Will we get it? Come on, man. Gang, this guy's fast. One more spear should get him, though. That's a reindeer. Kill that thing. Kill it. Missed. Kill it. It's in the water. I think they got it. It'll be dead when it comes along across the shore. We need one more reindeer. What is this? A boar. Kill the boar. We're killing a ton of things here. One more reindeer is all we need. Kill a younger one. It'll be easier. Major hunt here. Wow, that boar was a young female boar. We didn't get a lot from that. Lots of resources. Tons of food, bones, skin. We're gonna be fine. Just want to make sure I get this uh, flint here. Twelve. Looks like we got one. Four flint total. Acquired a hundred meat. That's another knowledge point. Fantastic. We're gonna be fine. 
Hunted the reindeer. Ten reindeer. We got another knowledge point there. We're at four knowledge points. One more, we'll get sling making. Yeah, I think we're doing pretty good. Raw skin. Might build another one of these skin dryers, maybe. Another one of those. I might even want another meat dryer too. Something that's expanding here. Let's do that. Ten sticks and four sticks. That's fourteen sticks. We got twenty. That's plenty. Alright. So that should help out a lot those kills. That's plenty of food for now. What else could we build? We don't have the technology to upgrade our housing just yet. I have one totem pole. Could try to do more. I know I'll definitely need more. Somebody died. That was from the cave lion attack. Check this out. Spirituality. Skull pole. Totem poles. I'm gonna have a lot of moons. I don't have a problem doing two of these, three of these. I like to get a little religious center going close to town. We should also probably put some further out, closer to other hunting and uh, gathering areas. Three totem poles. Nice round number, Rich. There we go. Alright, some more uh, spirituality. Some more food and clothing material production. And we've got some huts that need to be repaired. We've got plenty of skin to help with that. I think our settlement looks pretty good. Right by the pear tree. Oh, I thought that was a service tree. Service tree would be cooler. I don't know what the heck the service tree is or where that comes from. I got. I, I think I, I've given uh, too many jobs. We still haven't collected the meat from the cave line yet. How are we doing task-wise? 82% pending tasks include the mortar. What, the construction of the mortar? Did we not build it? Was that supposed to be built somewhere around here? That's a tanner. Where's the mortar? Mortar would be nice, because that could help us grind some of this uh, grain to flour. And maybe cook some bread on the hearth. Where is that? Oh, okay. Oh, we need, what, stone? Do I not have any stone? That's what's holding it up? I don't have stone? Where do I want to take the stone from? Not a lot of stone there. One stone, that's probably all you need. We'll gather that one. Oh, wow. I didn't realize that was holding me up. Alright, so we're going to have another food dryer. For the meat and any fish that we catch. I don't think I have anyone fishing. Banks are pretty wide open, probably. Both of those two banks. We'll save that for the winter. And maybe go on another hunt. I don't know. I want to gather up all this uh, material from the kills. Looks like we got the cave lines. The other ones are a little farther away. We killed something out here, right? I think we gathered all of it. Oh, we are gathering. That is a cave line. That's an injured cave line. We could kill that one easy. Let's kill that thing. I do want to kill that, actually. Acquired another 10 flint picks. Going to the crafter. 
need someone who's not doing work. Everyone seems to be pretty occupied right now. Some of these people are tired. Got a, a weak cave line that can easily, easily be knocked off. Lots of meat there. Wow, and it's going raw too. Okay, we gotta... Don't give them any assignments. Bringing raw meat into the storage tent, huh? Five pieces of raw meat. I didn't realize that it told you um, how quickly it was the, the material was deteriorating, or the resources were deteriorating. Going to get sticks. We don't have any sticks. I should not have assigned the totem pole at the same time. Totem poles same time as I was gathering all that food. I should have let that food come in first. But this totem pole, one one totem pole is done. Oh, that one's underway. That guy's praying. There was more meat and supplies out here too. That's a piece of raw meat. Gotta get the stuff out there. We got a lot of kills. How are we doing with meat? 31, 22 raw meat, 9 cured. What do we got on this thing? Yeah, it's a lot. Take that off the job list for now. Extra meat on the food dryer. Ah, I shouldn't have built those totem poles. Time management or prioritiz prioritization is very critical. In uh, planning out this game here, what else we got? Still have to get the rest of those bones. I guess probably won't decay as quickly. There's more reindeer out here. This meat is probably going bad. Eh, still got time. Condition is 63. Gives you a number too. Wow. That's awesome. All right, I think we got the rhino. We got all of the rhinos, meat and bones and skin so now we're gonna go after the other stuff one totem pole completed yep that's right and we need one stick for this totem pole they're working on repairing that tent still can't go hunt let's just speed this up a little bit Still in the springtime here. 30 meat, 18 raw, 12 cured. 4 dried fish. 17 raw meat. There's 3 there. And 8 there. That means we got 9 more that are not, it's not drying right now. I just put that, that on the stove there. Right on the hearth. Everyone's eating around the hearth. Looks like we're making some tools. Flint area exhausted. That's good. Six flint remaining. Alright, we're going to continue to need flint for the tool production. For now, that's what we got. Two flint in that rock pile. And let's check on our resources again. We are in the summer, so we can start gathering fruit soon. As soon as all the resources are gathered. 
I'd like to get one more reindeer too. I don't have anybody available really. Another totem pole has been constructed. What do you do? Gathering fruit? Alright, they're gathering fruit without me telling them. That's a good thing. I think they need the nutrition, right? Yep. I want to get these reindeer. This meat is all the way out here. Condition is 40. Yuck. Rotten meat. Who's going to get it? Sticks, huh? Go get this meat. That's a long trip for a boy, but we're going to send him on his journey there to get that raw meat. And then... The next step, I think once this totem pole is built, is to have somebody get the, oh it is built, okay. Just have somebody get the rock then. Then we can get the mortar and be making some flour and bread. Twenty meat. Do we eat a lot? I guess they ate a lot of it, hopefully. Hopefully none of it went bad. Seventeen cured meat. Dry skin. Okay, I'd say it's about time to start gathering fruit. Let's get some blueberries over here. Got some pear trees over here. What else do we have in the vicinity? Another pear tree. Take a swim in the lake and the river, cool off. Grab that pear tree. Do I have anything else in the woods here? More pears. Okay. Chestnuts aren't ready yet. Another pear tree. We're collecting a lot of the pear trees here. What do we got over here? Raspberries. Good. Alright, I don't want to get too much because last the uh, fall things went bad. Grab the pears from there. But they ate a lot of the meat. And I guess the uh, population. Is it higher now? 21? A lot of the meat. I hope it didn't go bad. I feel like a large number was lost there. Oh, this raw meat's going bad. He just grabbed it. 17. First structure, mortar knowledge has... Mortar has been built and... Now we have increased knowledge. Eight. More than enough to get uh, what we needed. Don't think that meat is gonna make it. Alright, time to find one hunter. If I could catch him. Wandering around. Where's that cable? I'm gonna give you something to do. Kill the cave line. Oh, what is that? There's a lot of animals around here. That's the cave line. Alright, I think you just need one spear probably to this guy. Send two people. There we go, there it is, hiding in the trees there. Get that cave line. Kill the predators. That will allow us more access to the prey, ideally. Alright, so the mortar looks like it's working. We have, uh, ooh, look at this. It's been an easy kill. Oh, that's such an easy kill. Gotta get a little closer, I think. Those guys are going after the cave line. But our mortar, which is right here, looks like it has produced some flour, which they will turn into bread on the hearth. That's the mortar. Focus camera. 
There it is. Here we go. Now we have some technology. You need like a stick there, you're just doing it with like your Jedi mind trick. Like, oh, turn to bread, oh. You will be bread. You do not need this much. You? No, you need moisture. Yeah. Alright, so we're lacking some graphics here. It would be better if they had a stick in their hand. I think I've seen them with sticks in their hands before. That's just. Yeah, I'm missing. They're missing that. Okay. Is that meat surviving? It's like done. It's like gross meat. That meat's gonna rot. But we've got a good amount of fruits. Six fruits. Some vegetables. Let's grab these blueberries too. All right. A lot of uh, fruit in the trees around here. Cherries. Not bad. New human was born. All right. After they kill this thing, then I'm thinking. You do not see me coming, do you? There they are. He's looking. He sees something. Something's going wrong. Oh! Got him. How much is it? Two skins and one raw meat and one bone. And this guy's gathering some fruit since he's out there. He's picking some raspberries to probably eat himself. And then this boar is getting closer and closer to the camp. I gotta kill it. It'll be such an easy kill. That's a kid. They're gathering fruit. Who's that? An old woman with a spear. Good enough. Hopefully she doesn't get attacked by that boar. Got some fruit gathering going on over there, and the boars are hanging out here. We're gonna take it out. Oh, I can call the alarm right there. Nice. Coming even closer. Perfect. Come closer to the camp. We can bring your resources in. Kill it. Got it. Four meat. One bone, two skins. Very good. Alright, our settlement is growing. We've got our two, three totem poles at this point. Let's take a look at these guys. Ooh, there we are. Memories of past hunts. Praying to the spirits of the dead animals that we killed and consumed. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. Um... But I think we have the infrastructure here for some big hunts. Enough for the skins and the drying. We have a sizable log pile right in the middle. Wood pile. Got our mortar for making grain. Of course, the hearth is important. The warmth, two crafters, three storage tents, a rock pile, and uh, a whole bunch of huts. For a settlement of 22 with a capacity of 30, that must mean we have 10? Yep. So we've got 10, not huts, 10 tents. I could probably line up more tents that way, so if I'm going to do that, I'm going to clear out that tree. Yeah, I'd like to get tents going around that way. That way they're close to the storage tents and they sort of actually provide some insulation and protection for many raiders, but we're not going to get raiders right away. I don't know how I'm going to defend this thing. Where I'm going to put the walls and whatnot. That's in a good view, actually. So I can just click on that when I need to. So chop down the tree, get that mine, bring in the rest of those uh, materials. We are well fed at this point. Let's check out, let's check out, check out the homeostasis. 98% welfare, measure of how well your settlement is doing, depends on people's stats, clothing, also food surplus, affects 
migrant arrival frequency and birth rate. All good stuff. And I've gone for about 30 minutes talking about this game. I love this game. I can go play this game all day long. Hope you guys like it. Snap a picture right there. Did I get it? Nope. There it is. And um, thanks for watching. Please leave a like if you liked it. And if you'd like to see more, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell button. And uh, I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching.